New at 10, outrage in the Delavan Darien School District. Several laid off teachers and parents are upset. Their former superintendent will be paid out more than $160,000. Ben Jordan explains why there's nothing that can be done about that. Laid off teachers say that $162,000 could be used to put two, three, maybe even four teachers back to work. However, the school board president says that money is locked into a contract. I was appalled. Uh, so many teachers have been affected, their families have been affected, our community has been affected. It's been three months since Carly Kramer Britt was laid off from her teaching job in the Delavan Darien School District. She's just one of 39. Has that been a hardship for your family? Absolutely. Uh, I have a new baby. He's three months old now. I have a three-year-old. The district's former superintendent, Dr. Bob Christ, was forced into an early retirement after a bookkeeping error led to mass layoffs. At that point, school board president, Dr. Jeff Scherer, says Christ was halfway through a two-year contract. We missed the date to not renew his contract by a long time, by more than a year. Scherer says the district likely would have gone into a legal battle if they hadn't paid Christ out, something they didn't want to be a part of. Do you understand their frustrations with that? Of course, of course. It's money that we don't have. As Kramer Bray continues her search for employment, she's upset her former boss gets to move on with a big paycheck. I believe he should have been fired and and publicly fired. This school district plans to give a $2.5 million referendum another go this fall. Sharer says it would increase their teaching staff by 25. In Delavan, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4.